Now to the plate. Here is Dansby Swanson. He'll start things out here in a tie ball game. Dansby Swanson. Wheels and deals. Here's the first pitch. Ball one. And a good heater as he just watches this baby a ball and a strike. In for strike two. Probably better that he let that pitch go anyway. After seeing a lively fastball on the pitch before, it's pretty hard to sit back enough on a well thrown changeup. Looking to punch him out again, the pitch. Tough ball. pitch to lay off there, but he did, and it's two even ball. up at two and two. two Bounce to first. Fielded cleanly, and he'll take it to the bag himself for the out. And now here is Greg Maddox. Worked a walk his first time up. Now here's the pitch. Fastball too, too high to start him out here, 1 0. Lifted down the line in left. Left fielder giving chase. He's got it. A nice play there. Two away. So next to hit is Eddie Rosario. A hit in two tries for him so far. Infield shifted well to the right. Here's the first pitch. Hey, this guy's got to be pretty proud of what he's done so far. It's never easy to pitch on the road, but to have this kind of outing in a ballpark that is notoriously known as being hitter friendly, it's been a treat to watch. Two out, nobody on. A ball and a strike now to the Atlanta leadoff man. Hey, if you're going to throw a pitch like that to this guy, that's right where you want to miss. Any lower, and he'll probably make you pay for it. Liner toward right center, and that's in for his second hit of the afternoon. So that'll extend the inning and let Freddie Freeman come to the plate. And they keep the now inning back. alive with a First base hit, but you can see that's only Freddy. the third hit. He's given up Freeman. the entire game, so he's still in total control out there. So next up will be Freddie Freeman. Comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. Coming here it is. Ball. Oh. And Ball. two and zero oh now as this misses below the knees. Now no this strike. is the kind of count this guy feeds on at the plate. You can bet he's geared to hit the fastball right here. The two zero, oh. and it's fouled away. And he gets him to wave at that one. It's two and two. That's not a pitch he misses very often. He knows he should have done something with that one. The two two. Three, ball, Three two. Two, right, two out. Runner on first. Lots of possible outcomes on this pitch. Now the payoff pitch home gets him looking up around the letters. One left for Atlanta. We played five full, tied at one aside. Now into the box, Joe Morgan, who went down on strikes in his last at bat. Yeah, but it was a good changeup, Maddie. Good arm action on that pitch. Look for him to try and stay back a little bit more. Let the ball get a little deeper. Ball. Don't be shocked if this pitcher tries to rush a heater right here. One and oh the count. Here it comes. No inside. And 
and that's over two and one. Hey, pretty aggressive pitch right there up in the zone. Surprised he didn't offer at it. That's bounced foul. It's two and two. Trying to send him packing for the second time. And a fastball oh, in the yeah. dirt that's Three taken ball. for a ball. And obviously, this guy's a double threat up there. He can run and he can go yard, too. You don't want to walk him because he might steal a base on you, but you don't want to groove a fastball either because he could take you out of the yard. And that's into the corner of foul ball and right. And he wants that swing back. He'll be thinking about that all night. He crushed that ball. He just needs to stay back a little longer. Still three balls and two strikes. The eighth pitch of the at bat. Tough That's pitch down. to lay ball off, four. but he did, and it's ball four, so the leadoff hitter is aboard to start the sixth. And I'm sure the manager is just oh, fine with that. I mean, it's better to battle a slugger like that to the end and end up walking him than serving on up where he can really hurt you. Next to dig in, Harold Baines, leadoff man on base, and we'll see what they have in mind strategy-wise here. Well, Matty, we know he's got the timing on the fastball locked in. That's what he got a hold of on that no, home run outside. in the previous at bat. You do not come off the heater. Have to be leery of the off speed, but stay on the fastball. He's got to throw it again. The 1 0. This is why I love having athleticism and speed on your team. You can tell the runner on first base is certainly messing with the mechanics of the pitcher. Now a throw over, and he's back easily. Too high, and it's three and oh. Sometimes you got to be aggressive offensively, but sometimes you just let the pitcher dig his own grave. Patience and discipline seem to be the way to go right here. The 3 0 pitch. It's a sinker that catches the zone. Well, it's been a good outing so far, but he hasn't really racked up the strikeout totals that you might think, Dan. Yeah, but for him, Matt, he's more of a pitch-to-contact kind of guy, and obviously it's working so far, and the way he pitches, it really keeps his pitch count down. Now a move over to first, but the runners back easily. The 3-1. Ground ball to second. This could be two. To second for one. Now over to Freddie, and it's a double play. Nice job on the mound to bounce back from the leadoff walk. Those are usually pretty costly, but that won't be the case this time after the two ball. Stepping in next, David Justice. No one on base for him after the double play. Yeah, and that, that two ball really changed the complexion of this inning. It looked like the middle of the order was going to have a chance to get a big hit with some ducks on the pond, but now they just have to try and get a two-out rally started. Here's the first pitch to him. Off-speed pitch ball. in the dirt as he takes it for One a ball. ball. No strike. Bases are empty here with two men out. Now it's 2 and 0. Oh. Here's the pitch. I think he would have liked the green light there. It's 2 and 1. Gutsy pitch right there. 2 0 -oh changeup for a strike. Good call by the catcher. Great execution by the pitcher. Now the 2 1. Will not ball. catch the zone. Ball three. three ball. Team's One been strike. struggling on offense. Let your D work for you right here. Pound the zone. Popped up. And no one can get there. It's a foul ball. It's going to be back to some serious T work if he can't put that pitch in play right in his wheelhouse. This should end the inning as it's sent out to second. And indeed it will. He throws him out at first, and the side is retired. Nothing doing there for the A's. Still tied one apiece. Bottom of the six.
extending now, and up steps Hank Aaron. The white blue. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Below the knees, one ball, no strikes. This guy's been throwing the ball great so far, but it's going to be tested here. Four, five, and six coming up this part of the lineup. Fly ball out to straightaway left. Left fielder giving chase, and he tracks it down. Nice play for the first down. Next up, Chipper Jones. 0 for 2 from him so far in this one. First pitch of the A.B. now. Ball. Fastball laid off well below the knees. One, One run on three hits and no errors so far for Atlanta. Well You're outside with the curveball for a ball. We've seen this before. Fastballs in, then breaking balls away. That's been his plan of attack throughout the first half of this game. From the windup, the 2-0 pitch. Ball to strike there, two and one. Ah, and Chipper so good at waiting for his pitch. He's got it to three and one now. Well, you can see here, this has been a steady diet of off speed pitches. And what has it gotten him? Not a whole lot as he's fallen behind in the count. Three balls and one strike. And an easy play out there as this is taken for the second out. The batter, number one. Next to hit is Ozzy Albies. He got under one and popped down his last time up. Yeah, I don't mind him trying to drive the ball in the air, but he can't collapse the backside, and that's exactly what he did in his last at bat. Look for him to stay a little taller and keep that upper half a little bit more over him. That elevated fastball right there, that is the biggest change in the game today for me. When I first came up, a lot of guys working at Greg Maddox east to west. The 0-2 home. Fouled off. The 0 2 once more. High in the air down the right field line. And no trouble for him as he makes the catch to end the inning. Braves are set down 1 2 3. Score remains tied 1 to 1. Here is Jimmy Fox. He'll start the seventh, and Dan, as a former pitcher yourself, you must be enjoying this. Lots of good pitching and defense today. Oh, that's one of the keys. We're seeing a lot of strikes. We're seeing a lot of swings. We're seeing some great plays on defense. This has been a snappy one up to this point. First offering on its way. A changeup floats outside here for ball one. One ball, no strike. Got him out on his front foot Play there as it swung on and missed for strike one. Fouled away. And they come inside with the fastball, but it misses here, and it's back to two and two. Well, two straight fastballs inside haven't put him away, so now it'll be interesting Down to see four. what he turns to. Count two full, strikes. three balls and two strikes. Now the three and two pitch. He is swung on and missed. He got him on strikes. Well, pitching domination continues. Just a total of two runs on the board. So both of these starters should feel really good about their showings. If you love good pitching, this has been the game for you. 